Let's talk origin. Uh, the LEC, Tyler, uh, released a video uh, talking with multiple players around the league, asking them who their most overrated and underrated players were uh, so far this split. And upset uh, was in both lists, second for most overrated, also second for most underrated. So uh, where, where does he fit uh, among Origin and their success, in your opinion? Uh, uh, it, it makes sense, right? I mean, upset is that late game carry who is put into a team that's very boring. And I've said this many times, they're very boring. They're very consistent. They don't take fights where they don't think they can win 100% of the time. And it puts him in that late game position where he's farmed up, the team plays around him, and in those moments he shines. And for a lot of people, they see that and say, hey, on a weaker team, on a team that isn't prepped perfectly around him with stars around him, he's not that good. And then you look at other people who are saying, to do that consistently and be that late game carry like the Teddy, like the ruler player he is, that's impressive. So I can see both sides of the coin. I think he's very impressive. And OG, as I said last week, they're gonna get wins. And they're boring, yes. They don't play the most exciting style. But I, I'm actually going to come out and say that people who think, don't think they're a good team because they play a slow style are, are ludicrous. It's, it's asinine and it's short-sighted. But playing slow and having a slow identity isn't a bad thing. We've seen champions before win with a slower-paced style. Sure, different metas. But here's the thing. Team Liquid beat IG last year at MSI by playing a slower style. The issue of... Team Liquid is that they didn't have anything else in their sleeve, right? They could only play that one style. OG can play a slow style, but they also need to be able to hurry up and play a faster game if needed. And we saw this this weekend against Rogue, where they dominated Rogue in the early game. Rogue, one of the best early game teams in the league, and a team I think is very, very good, they dominated them in the early game. Alfari is one of the best laners in the entire league. Upset can hold his own against anyone in lane. Nuka Duck is a veteran and, and has shown time and time again he can stand up in the mid lane. So this team can play fast. Xerxes is one of the best early game junglers in the league. It's just that it, it, a lot of times they're going to play it safe. They're going to stretch it out and make sure they're going to win. So for OG, I, I don't see their slow play as, as a detriment because when, it, when it's needed, they can play fast as shown versus Rogue. If you can only play one style and it's slow, you're probably not going to win many titles. But if you can play slow and safe, but also throw that curveball in at times where you can play a sped up style, you can win some championships. Connect.